Alrighty, so it is my turn to talk about essential oils and emotions. I feel like I got the lucky end of the straw be or stick, whatever you want to call it, um, because I get to talk to you guys about Stress Away. Um, but before I get into that, I just wanted to give you a little bit of my backstory. My name is Stephanie Nichols, and I'm an executive with Young Living. Um, I just started with oils about two and a half years ago, and um, it definitely wasn't something that I really knew a lot about. One of my girlfriends actually bought me the kit as my birthday present, um, but it definitely has changed my life. And um, when it comes to essential oils and emotions, I don't know a whole lot. I've just recently been really looking into that just because I realized that they could really be helping me and my family a lot. Um, so I am speaking about stress away because I use it every day. <laughs> um, I have three kids, three kids currently, um, four years and under, and then we're expecting another one here in about eight weeks. So all that being said, I've been using essential oils to help my emotional state. I am pregnant and I'm tired and I go through mood swings like crazy, it seems like. So um, I am really excited to be talking with you guys about how essential oils have been affecting me and helping my kids. And so anyways, all that being said, we're going to get into this bottle. This is like life <laughs> in a bottle for me right now. I use it all the time. I use it every single day. I use it on my children. Um, I put it in the diffuser. It's like if I don't get my dose of stress away at least once during the day, my day is hectic. So um, just to give you a little bit of info about Stress Away, it does come in the premium starter kit. You would get a smaller bottle, not the 15 milliliter. You would get a 5 milliliter bottle of it. Um, but it has copaiba, lime, cedarwood, oka tea, lavender, and then some vanilla. So the smell is beautiful. I love the smell. I think that was the original reason why I started using it was because it was just one of my favorite smelling oils. Um, but recently... I've been noticing how it has been affecting my emotions so much, more than just the smell. Like I used to diffuse it just because I, I wanted to smell it throughout the day, but now I'm realizing when I don't use it or I don't apply it, I notice how my mood is very different. So I'm just going to go through each of the oils that are in Stress Away and just explain how they can actually affect your emotions. So I am going to be looking at my notes over here. but. Um, the first one is Copaiba. Now that one does come in the premium starter kit as a single oil. Um, and that one by itself, I use a lot on my children as well. That one helps elevate your mood and it lifts negative emotions. It amplifies other oils. So all of the other oils that are in this, this blended oil are amplified because the Copaiba is in there. But Copaiba by itself is already a mood enhancer. It's a negative feeling lifter. Um, and so it's just that oil by itself is already really good, but it's put in the special blend, which makes it even better. Um, the next oil that's in there is lime. I don't know if you've smelt lime by itself. A lot of the citrus oils, they're just really uplifting. They uplift your mood. They make you a little bit more happy and cheerful. Um, but lime has a fresh and lively smell, but it also is a very stimulating and refreshing smell. So you know, as I'm going throughout the day, as I'm smelling stress away, it does kind of uplift me, rejuvenate me a little bit, refreshes me, um, and I love, I love the smell of lime by itself anyways. The next one that's in there is cedar wood. Cedar wood, again, I use that as a single oil all the time on my kids. Probably every morning I use cedar wood. Um, it's very calming. I don't love the smell of cedar wood by itself. But when it's in the stress away, you can hardly even smell it. Um, but cedar wood's properties are very calming and it eliminates nervous tension. So stress away is also really good for any type of public occasion that you're, you know, maybe speaking at or that you're going to that you're feeling nervous about. Um, so cedar wood is just a really good oil by itself. So again, paired with all of these other oils that are mood enhancers and mood lifters, it just makes it that much better. Um, there's oka tea in there, which is really good just for emotional balance. Um, so for myself, like I said, I'm pregnant right now, so putting some stress away on just kind of helps balance me out throughout the day. I'm able to use it, apply it, reapply it as many times as I need, and it just helps 
get me in a mental state where I am level, hopefully. <laughs> so anyways, um, emotional balance. That's huge for me right now. Lavender. Lavender is relaxing. I mean, okay, you guys, lavender, seriously, it's like the powerhouse oil, in my opinion. Again, I use lavender by itself all the time, especially on my children. It does wonders on my kids. So um, lavender is relaxing. It promotes health, just overall health and well-being. So you're mixing lavender in with all of these other oils, with the copaiba but that's enhancing all the properties of these other oils. And you have yourself a very powerful blended oil. Um, like I said, I use it every single day. So what I do with it personally is I put it on the back of my neck, I put it on my wrist, and then I put it behind my ears. That's what I usually do with it. Um, you can get it in a roller ball. I don't know. Sometimes it's out of stock. Sometimes it's not. But even if you can't get it in the roller ball bottles, you can just buy the attachments or like the the Aroma Fit roller ball things. You can get packs of 10 of those for, I think, 10 bucks or something. And so you can make your own little roller balls of stress away. And then you can carry them in your purse, carry them with you wherever you're going. Um, and it's just really great to have on hand. I love it. Again, I use it all the time. Um, my mom, she uses it before bed, and it just helps promote a healthy night's sleep. Um, just really helps aid her in turning off mentally, like just shutting off and being able to relax and get calm before going to bed. Um, there also is just a hint of vanilla in there, and I love the smell of vanilla. I don't, I don't really know a whole lot of people who don't love the smell of vanilla. So anyways, again, the smells of Stress Away just make me so happy. Now, I personally um, pair my stress away with uh, joy in the morning just because, again, I need that extra boost of happiness. <laughs> and joy is like happiness in a bottle. I love it. Um, I really, on days that I don't use it, I definitely notice a difference. So being able to apply the stress away just to alleviate some of those like negative feelings in the morning, but then putting joy over my heart, I just always feel so much better when I do that and when I'm consistently using it. So um, I was going to touch a little bit on oil frequency. Um, and again, I'm not super knowledgeable about this and you can do your own research on it. But um, because the molecular structure of oil, of essential oils is so small, it's able to break through that blood brain barrier. And again, I'm not super scientific, so I don't know a ton of information on that. And I'm sure Anna or Tracy could expound more on this. But um, the blood-brain barrier is something that not a whole lot of things can get through, you know. And it's obviously, it affects your brain. And so if you are using essential oils, because the essential oils are so powerful and because the frequency is so high... Um, it's able to break through that barrier and really affect your brain and obviously affect the moods of your body and all that kind of stuff. So um, I must say, out of all of the essential oil things that I had heard, the emotional part, I was like, whatever. You know, I was very skeptical of it. But then, like I said, within the last couple of months, as I was using the oils and noticing how my mood was being affected by using them, or when I wasn't using them, then I realized, you know, these are very powerful and they are able to affect the way that I conduct myself throughout the day. Um, I am a Christian. I believe in the Lord and I love God. <laughs> um, and so I will say, you know, essential oils are a huge part of my mood, but my walk with the Lord is an even bigger part. And so if I'm choosing to not walk in the spirit and not be um, walking with him and just having a crappy attitude and letting that get to me. It doesn't matter how many oils I use, my mood's going to be bad. So for me personally, that's my own opinion. Um, so I do use my essential oils, but I get my quiet time in the morning. I pray throughout the day. Um, so those are just things that I pair with my oils to make my mood that much better. Um, so I hope this was a little bit informative for you guys that you get your premium starter kit if you don't have one and then you get some of that stress away and you rub it all over you right away <laughs> it's also great for like bath salts if you just want to soak in a bathtub full of stress away it's amazing so um anyways thanks for tuning in i really hope that this was helpful and informative for you guys and uh enjoy the rest of the class